A man goes into a public restroom and gets trapped in a time paradox. Everybody lock in. Four dollar cup of coffee, two hundred dollar shirt. Yeah. Pete, where are you? I'm on my way right now. You're late. It's three ten. No, it's three thirty. Everyone's here. Well, I'm looking at a thousand dollars. of Italian engineering says everyone's early. All right. Look, John can get you what? started. No, as soon John can as you... kiss my ass. He had his chance with the Weller account. His door closed and my door opened. Well, John's actually here, Pete. Why don't you two what? tag team? This is my moment, Craig. My future. You understand me? If you let him in that room, I swear to God, I will make sure. Okay. That he... Okay. What if the Weller reps want to get started? Stall, Craig. Lie to them. I'm stuck in traffic. Can I get anything ready? For Can he snap it at the janitor? Oh, hell no. Yo, I don't even need fuck. Yo, if there's no paper towels visibly in sight, I'll just wash my hands and walk out of the, wash, walk out of the bathroom with wet ass hands do y'all do that like i'll wash my hands and i'll go and then i'll just pat it on I'll, I'll do this and then i'll walk out it's just water towels man paper towels towels not you uh, he knows this account what john what did i just say well, i heard you but if, if you're not if gonna get here. anybody screws this pitch up before i get in there anybody I will kill them. Do you understand me? I will literally shoot them in the head. Yeah, all right. Gee, Pete, calm Don't down. tell me to calm down. Can I help you with something, Mr. Clean? I guess not. Just get Not you, as moron. Fast as you this old man about to fucking shank him. You are a bad person. Wow. Uh-huh. And you're a janitor. One day... You might just get a good look at yourself. One day, you might not like what you see. Hey, whatever helps you work at night. Oh, he just gave him the shits. But he has the Taco Bell poops. You ever run into a fucking public restroom? You have to take a shit so bad and all the stalls are taken? Oh, my God. Then you got to do the fucking squeeze in the ass cheeks method. You got to fucking sit there. Your legs are basically crossed. Fucking praying to God you don't shit your pants. Then you just barely make it in time. Oh, that's the worst. Oh, my God. Okay. You think it's the same person? Oh, are you predicting that that's him when he's older? There's no way he's stuck for that long. No joke. No lie. Yeah, about to rip that bitch open. Yo, he ain't even going to take the suit jacket off. What if he shits on it? He's late for a meeting and he's really going to take a dump. I would just fucking leave. That would scare the fuck out of me. What would you guys do if you're taking a shit and somebody's just fucking hawking over you? You see their shoes? It's occupied. Who sits on a public toilet seat? Me. Me. And I'll, I'll say that shit unfucking phase. Me. Me. I'm that menace, right? I, I'm, not, I'm not taking the time. If I'm going to take a shit, I'm not going to fucking delay the toilet paper on the seat. Unless it's like a grimy ass bathroom, right? Like if I was at like a McDonald's, I'd fucking do that, right? But if I'm at like a regular restaurant bathroom, I'm bare ass sitting on that fucking toilet seat and I'm just gonna take a shit. Cause at the end of the day, it's my ass. It's my ass. Why do I care if my ass has bacteria on it? Don't panic. Hey, I'm gonna be here a minute, asshole. Hey! Hey! What is happening out there? What the hell is happening out there? 
You want me to come out there? Wasn't that what he's not supposed to do? It said, don't panic. It was probably a message from himself. Hey. And no one's there. What? what he didn't wipe. He didn't wipe. I mean, did he really shit, though? Like, he sat on the toilet for, like, 10 seconds. He might have not gotten the fucking deuce out, right? He might have not been able to squeeze it. Hey! Hey! Asshole! Open up! I'm still wiping? Yeah, at least a check wipe. No service. Oh, and he's gonna look at the person that... Oh, there's gonna be somebody in the fucking... <gasps> it's gonna be him now. And he's gonna be looking at the guy in the bathroom. Hey, I'm gonna be here a minute, asshole. God, and now he's the fucking third guy. Now he's not there. What the fuck? Right, you want me to come out there? He has to hide. Oh, no, but now it's quiet. <gasps> A gun. <laughs> I, he, all the toilet paper keeps saying don't panic hey I know this is weird but you're trapped in a time paradox yeah it's time travel yeah I don't know it's just happening forward backward minutes or seconds Totally random time travel. One door open. Yo, if y'all were in this, do you think you would be able to get out? By writing notes to yourself. Over time, maybe. But his, if he's dying, wouldn't it be an alternate version of him? Like, he's not having all the memories at once. It's different hymns. So he would still die. It would just be a different parallel him. Another closes. Fix the paradox. Kill your future. Kill your future. What? You were right. You were right. About the stalls. You just go in, come out. That's how it works. Oh. I just told me that. This isn't real. That's what I said. You're not real. That's what I said. Go into the stall. You'll see. I'm not going anywhere. That's what I Don't said. Don't say that's what I said. Look, man. I know you're freaked out. Believe me. A couple minutes ago, when I was you. Yo, I'm sorry I'm not talking, chat. This, I'm just so zoned in. I didn't believe me either. But if you go into that stall and come back out, you're going to be right where I'm standing now. And you'll see what I'm talking about. Really?
And that's why he'll fucking redo that. But then where are the other hymns going? So now he's going to go into the stall. He's going to come out. And that's why he said that to him. And he was like, well, I actually told myself that. I'll see. You will be me. No. 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 Oh, he could break it. What? No. No. What? This is different. <gasps> I didn't say that. This is all different. I would be worried okay. they would try to kill me. So there's like a timeline. Dead guy's watch is broken here at 3.30. That's 10 minutes from now by my watch. Yeah, it's 12 by mine. Okay, so you are two minutes in the past from where I am. And it's different thems. Dude, this this movie is fucking nuts. Thing about folding a piece of paper. And this is so confusing. I understand it. Are y'all getting it right now? I mean, you're not supposed to understand why it's doing this, right? You're only supposed to understand that he has a different version of himself, uh, maybe a future, se a future self and a past self that he's constantly interacting with. And he's trying to predict a way to get out of this loop. And that's why this initially started is when his, his response was not normal and did not line up with the linear path that his did. Pencil through it. We're doing 80s time travel. I'm here, you're here. We die here somehow. If we're gonna make it out of here alive, we've gotta keep here from happening, right? So, we go here instead. Create a new timeline. That's how Dr. Marty did it. Okay. Happen. Easy. You're me from the future, right? Yeah. So I just do something you did. Future's changed, new timeline. No, that's the problem. I went into the stall again and you didn't. You should already be me, but you're not. That's the paradox. Now we both just exist. Wow! Wow! Oh my god, this is literally like multiverse shit. Yo, this is literally like what actually fucking Marvel should be. When all the universes fucking collide, or collide and all that shit. No, that is nuts. So if he went into the stall, he somehow would have disappeared. I think that's because there is only one him. There is only one him. He's interacting with future and past selves, right? But because he didn't follow what his future self did, now there's two of him. And so it's split. Like how that paradox where if you go back in time and you kill your father, you would still exist, but there would be a different universe where you didn't. It would be like a similar thing like that. Now we both just exist. <sighs> right. Okay, so the note said, kill the future, close the door. Close it. So, but who wrote that for them? Somebody's already done this. So, you're from the future. Yeah. Oh, come on. Look, I'm not saying it's pretty, but if you, then I can do this. And why would I do that? Oh, no, but then he's just going to be the guy that kills himself. Looks like you already have. I don't even have a gun. Sure you do. Where did that thing even come from? It came from you. I don't have it. Then take it. From who? Yourself. Why do I have because it? Because you took you know, it. They're arguing with each other about who has to kill themselves. Look, it's time travel. Don't overthink it. I think I would overthink that, okay? If I'm him, I'm not going to be like, oh, wow, perfect sense. The toilet paper notes told me to kill myself. So why don't I just grab the gun? See you later. Bang. Like, what? I'd say, you know, maybe actually let's rewrite this note a little bit, see if we can both get out of here. I got a meeting to get to. What? The meeting? Whoa. Let's overthink this. I want to overthink this. And he's Look, gonna man, be gone. you can't change the future. You're from the future. Two minutes? And that means that I'm in the past, so I should be the one to change the future. No, because what if I'm in the future from the past? If you're in the future, how can you change it? It's got to be me in the past changing the future. No, 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 okay, fine. You're right, but look, Marty McFly, McFly's dad. You kissed your mom. Now I go into the stall, that's me punching Biff. You shoot yourself, that bullet's your DeLorean. You mean lightning strike? Yeah, whatever, as long as it kills you. Hey, look at me. The writing's on the toilet paper, okay? Your door closes and my door opens. Kill your future, that's what it says. And that's you. I'll thank myself later. Nice.
Nice, very, that's very charming. What? What? That was the guy from the past. That was the guy from the past. That's very charming. How did the guy from the past die? Kill your future. That's what it says. And that's you. I'll thank myself later. Nobody gets in the way. Not even me. Oh, this is a flashback. <gasps> Wait, what? What? Way to take one for the team, Pete. You look like a good guy to me. When your door closes, my door. <gasps> Who are you? I'm me. Who are you? But I, but just... I just. So we're right back where we started. Whoa, whoa, what are you doing? I'm gonna try again. Whoa, what do you mean, try again? Well, you came out before I did, so your future me? Yeah, so? So there's the gun. Kill the future. I just went through this with the other no, guy. No, I just went through this with the other guy. Okay, so then you know. Whoa, whoa, hold up. That's not fair. Yeah, that's what the other guy said. He's gonna open it to that guy's dad, or he won't come out. Oh, what the fuck? No way he actually kills himself. What is happening here? He has to kill himself to end it? I don't think that's true. You think he really just has to die to be able to get out? What is happening here? It's not working. That's you what's what happened. happened. That first guy didn't off himself. That's what happened. I knew I couldn't trust myself. Wait, what's not working? Now we just keep spawning morons. What did you just say? He called you a moron. Right, guys, oh, there's, there's gonna be an infinite number of them, dude. They're gonna start murdering each other. Just chill. That's the problem. We just keep creating more paradoxes. Every step is a step in the wrong direction. Hey, this is it. What? Last requests. What? Wait, why did he just go into that door? What was that clip? Let me get it. You don't fix a paradox, gentlemen. You finish it. Time to close some doors. What are you Get doing? In that stall right now. What? Why are you doing this? Why? Because there's one body unaccounted for. And that's you in that stall at 3.30. Get in the stall! Get in! Put your jacket back on! Yo, I'm like not listening to future me. Chat, future you comes out of the stall with the gun and says the only one missing is you in the stall. Uh, dickhead, even if I listen to you, you're gonna fucking kill me. You're gonna kill me if I don't listen to you. If I do listen to you, you're also gonna kill me. 
so I'm just going to fucking fist fight your dumb ass and see if I can get out of here. Jay for the sub. Brad, yeah, like, dude, dude's, like, threatening him with a gun. Like, if he cooperates, he's not going to still kill him. It's almost time. I can still make the end of it. He's going to be the one that dies because he's covered in blood. He's going to be the dude in the suit jacket. To the meeting? You're crazy. <laughs> yeah, you and me both. Okay. Don't do this, man. Shut up. I've, I've got just as much right Don't. as you. Who do you think you're talking to? I know all your little tactics. All your bullshit. At the end of the day, you're just a manipulative asshole, aren't you? You want me to feel bad about this? I know for a fact that you do the same. Your door closes and my door opens. I'll thank myself later. Nah, this him's gonna live because he's realizing how shitty he is. And that guy's gonna die and then he'll be able to get out. You really are a bad person. Oh, did he disappear? Any last requests? Maybe just a little privacy? No! Yo, did he get out of there? Nah. Hey, this is it. What? Last requests. No! crazy that is fucking crazy dude there's no fucking way wait wow oh is that not it is that not the end get this man on movies dude this is such a fucking good film oh my god this is such a good fucking film it only has a million views And he's there. And that's the guy that killed himself in the beginning that he saw. Two in the stall. Oh, but he's not out yet. the guy that's writing the toilet paper but the what the fuck so is he never gonna get out he need to do another setup if he was the if he got out why did he need to do another setup i'm not understanding dude what a good fucking film why why did he need to fucking redo the toilet paper setup so he would be able to pull the door for the next person but it's him it's just him he was the janitor he was not the fucking janitor chat what the fuck are you talking about he was the janitor so after escaping the time paradox, he loses his job because he was, was late slash quits because he wants to change his life. He becomes a janitor and grows old. One day, he's cleaning the bathroom and sees his younger self walk in, realizing he is in the back in the paradox. He leaves himself a hint for how to escape and leaves the toilet paper on the counter and walks out, leaving his younger self to his own devices. Oh my god, that gave me fucking chills, dude. What a good writer. The last thing he does before leaving is set up the paper towel roll that was there before he, his first self entered, which means that he is now leaving the bathroom at a time before he originally first entered it, before he was late in the first place. If he actually wanted to, he could have made the meeting all along. 
which if he did would mean there would be no reason for the other guy to call him. So no angry conversation in front of the janitor and likely no prompt for the time paradox to happen at all. It is ultimately his decision to be a changed person and blow off the meeting that caused the whole situation, thus the change in the first place. <gasps> what? This is an amazing fucking film. Oh my God, dude. And it's Amaletto, which I think uploads other people's films. Dude, I wish I knew who fucking originally wrote this. Is that the original? I got a film submit it for consideration. Maybe they did submit it. I don't know. It said the writers, though. Matt Black, dude. What a good fucking writer. All right. Yo, W fucking stream chat. I'll catch y'all tomorrow. W long stream. I'll catch y'all 2 p.m. EST. <laughs>